Hello everyone. So in this video, we'll try to install the Olama and then we'll use the lang extract using the Olama. So what I will do is simply first, um, I'll just go with this uh, Microsoft Store and I will Im install the Ubuntu on my local. So if you go to the store and make sure that you have a WSL enabled. So I'll choose this um, any of this um, Ubuntu. I'll just go with the latest one and I'll just click on this install. So again, this will take some time. Once it is installed, just click on open, which is start installing on a WSL. This I'll click on e. any username password. We'll just use the root. And just go with that sudo su so that you are in the root. Okay. Okay. So now, first of all, you need to update the packages. So apt update and apt upgrade. And then you need to do an apt upgrade. Don't worry about the commands. I'll share with the share the GitHub repository where in the readme md everything is there. Okay, so once this is done, now it's time to install the Olama. So there is a command again. This has been shared in the readme file, the project. Once this is done, just start the Olama. And then Olama service to be enabled. Okay, but what if we want a remote access? So this command, edit Olama. And here you just need to put um, like this service environment and this will allow the remote host to connect to Olama. Okay, say yes and save it and enter. Okay, so once this is done, you need to restart the Olama service. Okay, and now it's time to pull this any model that you want. I'm currently go with this minimal model this llama 3.2 lb for demo purpose so this may take some time i'll pause the video once it is installed now you can create a new python project and i would simply give this python olama okay. an example and i said this is 001 Click on create. I'll click on this new window. Okay. Now go to this terminal. Okay. And save. I would simply create a file main.py. Okay. And what I'll do is simply pip install lang extract. Okay. Okay. Once it is installed. Just um, I'm just copying because we already seen how this uh, program works. I'm just copying <coughs> a program and we'll try to run. And here um, you just need to change the IP address. So what you can do to get the IP address, you can just simply say the host name and I. Okay. So this is your IP address. And we'll go to this program. And we'll change our IP address, okay? Right. So let me go walk you through this example. We installed or import the library, and then we have the prompt. This time we are using the retail uh, related prompt. And then we have the examples. So we just give examples, and we get the extractions. Okay. I give the four to five extraction where you have extension class going text and the attributes okay and then we have the input text okay and then we have this result extraction okay where we are using this model id and model url and this is required for the case of the olama okay and then we have the visualization so let's try to run it so it just started running in 
will provide you few of the option all right so now um, it is uh, completed and we have this visualization and I'll just go is open browser and this Chrome okay and if you go here and we can have a beautiful um, UI and we have a reference to these things we have the first one is Apple and you can see the class is retail brand type electronics category is smartphone and accessories target market tax is consumer the next one is like for advanced camera system a retail brand again electronics and then we can go sorry this is now again uh, product sentiments on um, the positive like for an advanced consumer and then we can go with this aggressive trade promotion you can see the short a promotional campaign a purpose is incredible okay you can go and you have a reference to this retail brand all right so that's pretty much about Olama and this uh, if you're more interested in more examples then then we can have this uh, my course lang extract from unstructured text to a structured data this is the only course currently available uh, on um, Udemy uh, on lang extract so you can just take a leverage if you need a coupon you can tell me I'll just provide it all right so that's it for this video thanks for watching See you in the next video.